everyone, it's Taylor and today I'm going to be showing you a few of my fitness favorites including my favorite fitness bag, a few pairs of sneakers, leggings, and a few other things. So if you guys want to see this video then just keep watching. I'm going to do a quick shameless self promotion. Please go follow my Instagram as well as my Twitter. They are both just at SimplyTaylorB. I am constantly on Instagram, so please go check that out if you guys are interested. So with that all said and done, let's just continue on with the video. Sports bras are clearly an addiction of mine. When I first started working out, I literally wanted to buy every single sports bra that I saw. The first one being this blue Raikai um, little sports bra it is so comfortable. It was from TJ Maxx. This next one is a little torn up. It is from Forever 21. I gotta say, I got this a really long time ago, so I'm not sure if they improved their quality, but this has been a favorite of mine just because of the way it looks. It's a tie-dye pink, and it also has the padding in there. Another really comfortable one, and, and I really am interested in Forever 21 Fitness, so I think I'm gonna go on a little shopping spree over there pretty soon because I've heard a lot of good things about their fitness apparel and this one is definitely one of my favorites. This next one has been seen on my Instagram before. It is another one from TJ Maxx. Just holding it up for you guys doesn't give it justice. It just looks like a basic like salt and pepper type of sports bra but the back is actually really cool. These go into like little triangles on your back and it's a really nice fit. This is by the brand Climawear. I don't really have anything like this, but it matches a pair of leggings from a different company, so I decided to get that. Next, I'm gonna be talking about a few shirts that I always am wearing, and also a sweatshirt that I live by. My two favorite shirts are from Nike. This first one is just a black v-neck. I'm pretty sure I got this at the Nike store a while back, but this one is a dry fit long sleeve, or yeah, it's a long sleeve. Um, just a long sleeve workout shirt and I got it from TJ Maxx, pretty sure it was around $16 and this is so nice to wear over a sports bra so then you can just take it off. I usually wear it to spinning class because I sweat a lot when I go to spinning class so I just take off the shirt and then I'm left in my sports bra. I am a Nike fanatic. Um, this next thing that I am obsessed with is this Nike long sleeve sweatshirt. I got this from Nordstrom Rack, I'm pretty sure. This is another thing that I love to just wear over a sports bra so then I can just take it off and show off those cute sports bras. Now I have to talk about my absolute favorite athletic legging wear companies. Now I have to talk about my favorite athletic wear legging company and it is called Kyodan. I would not mind being sponsored by Kyodan because I live in their leggings. This first pair is some pair that I just got about a month ago and they are a quarter length and they have this really cool like almost like kaleidoscope-ish, I don't even know what this would be considered but these snug your body so well. I always had the problem when I first started buying leggings that they would just slip right down my body even if my legs were growing. I was like, oh, maybe my legs just are awkward and don't fit into leggings. Nope, it just was a certain type of leggings that would not want to fit on my body. But this brand snugs my legs so well. They are from TJ Maxx. I want to say the capris are about $20. The long pants are about $25. And the back has a little zipper. And I've heard that these are like a knockoff of Lululemon. I don't own Lululemon leggings because I don't see the point of spending like $90 on a pair of leggings when these honestly are just as good to me. I am obsessed and I'm going to show you guys a few more pairs of these that I am always constantly grabbing. This next pair has just gray and black stripes. It has no zipper on the back, but still I don't even use the zipper but it has a little pocket right here. I think that's for a key, but honestly, I don't think I would put a key in there just because why, but I am obsessed. They fit so nicely. I can't even emphasize how well they fit. I think all of my workout leggings except for two pairs are by this brand and I own a lot of workout leggings. If you guys wanna see my legging collection, like 
full on, then comment down below because I could definitely do like a try on with these because you will be able to see how well they fit. It's amazing. Another thing that I love from that company, you would think that this video is sponsored by them because I'm talking about Kyodon so much. Another thing that I'm obsessed with is my workout bag. It is by that same brand, Kyodon. It has so many compartments, got it from TJ Maxx, pretty sure it was around $45. My dad actually got me this and it has a blue inside. I carry this around the gym with me when I'm working out because it has, I always have a jacket in there, a few drinks, and my ankle weights. I, I love this brand. Like, can I be this brand, please? Next, I'm going to be talking about my favorite shoes. And I only own a few pairs of workout shoes because workout shoes are pretty expensive. But my two favorites are from Nike. These first shoes that I constantly am wearing are my Nike Roshis or Rashis. A lot of people pronounce them differently, but these are just my black, white, and silver Roshis. I usually wear these when I'm doing cardio, if I'm just running on the treadmill or going on the elliptical or something. These next ones that I am always wearing are the Nike Trainee Core Motion TR2s. I got these from TJ Maxx for a pretty reasonable price. I'm not sure how much, but I don't remember spending that much money. And these I wear when I'm doing the more intense machines, like the leg press, my squats. I wear these for spinning class. I don't have spinning shoes yet, but these are really tough on the outside, but my Roshis are like a mesh. So these protect my feet a little better. So that is it for a few of my fitness favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're interested in other fitness videos like what I eat before the gym, what I eat after the gym, what workouts I do, then you know, you can let me know in the comments down below because I could definitely get that out for you guys. If you guys want to check out my last video, it'll be the first link in the description below. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.